Hi friends, welcome to everyone, in this video, you can understand, lathe, accessories. If you like this video, like, comment, share, and, subscribe. Ok, let's we go to the topic. Lathe accessories are, commonly used in lathe machining operations. That accessories may help to work, where, existing machine components, cannot help to work, and cannot do the work properly. For example, complicated profile work pieces, long length work pieces, and non-cylindrical work pieces. Some of the common accessories, are described in the following. Lathe chucks, three jaw chuck, four jaw chuck, collet chuck, lathe centers, live center, dead center, tip center, ball center, Lathe mandrels, plain mandrel, step mandrel, collared mandrel, screwed mandrel. Three jaw chuck is also called self centering chuck or universal chuck. Three jaws and three square slots or holes are provided on the circumference of the body. By inserting the key in any one slot, all jaws can be moved simultaneously. Speedy centering of the workpiece. Cannot hold, large size of workpiece. This chuck is easier to operate than four jaw chuck. Four jaw chuck, is also called, independent chuck. Used to hold, square, rectangular, regular, and irregular shapes of workpieces. Initially, to set the workpiece, it takes more time. This chuck includes, four independent jaws. Four square holes, on circumference of the body. By using key, jaw can be taken in, or out, independently. Combination chuck. Jaws can be moved in, and out simultaneously, or independently. Advantages of both the varieties in this chuck, so it is called, combination. Scroll plate is used, to move the jaws, simultaneously. A screw is used for independent movement. Magnetic chuck. Used to hold, thin work pieces, which can't hold, by chuck. An electromagnet, or permanent magnet, provides the holding power. In all position flux, passes through the work piece, and holds. Collet chuck. In production shop, speedy, and accurate centering of work piece, is necessary. Hence, to hold, the bar stock collet chuck is used. Outer portion of collet, is tapered. Drill chuck. Used for drilling, reaming, and tapping operations. It is held in the sleeve, of the tail stock, or, spindle of the head stock. It contains, key operated centering jaws, for holding the tool. Lathe centers. Work to be turned between centers, must have center hole drilled in each end. Provides, bearing surface. Support, during cutting. Most common have, solid Morse taper shank, 60 degree centers, steel with carbide tips. Care to adjust, and lubricate, occasionally. Steady rest. The base is, made up of cast iron. It is clamp, on the lathe bed, where, the workpiece is to be supported. Three jaws are provided. All jaws, can be radially moved, with independent screw. Follower rest. It is C-type in shape. Two adjustment jaws, to support the workpiece. It is fitted, on the rear portion of the carriage, by bolt, hence it moves, along with the carriage. Used during the finishing operations, or, for carrying out turning, along the entire length of the jaw. Mandrels. Mandrels is used to hold, the hollow, or, drilled workpiece. Types of mandrel. Plain mandrel. Collar mandrel. Special mandrel. Step mandrel. Cone mandrel. Expansion mandrel. Gang mandrel. Lathe faceplate. A lathe faceplate, is a flat round plate, 
that threads to the headstock spindle, to the lathe. The faceplate is used for, a regularly shaped workpiece, that cannot be successfully held, by chucks. Lathe dogs. Lathe dogs are, cast metal devices, used to provide a firm connection, between the headstock spindle, and, the workpiece mounted between centers. Driving plate. The driving plate is, used to drive a workpiece, when it is held, between centers. It is a circular disc, screwed to the nose of the lathe spindle. It is provided with small bolts, or, pins, on its face. Work pieces fitted inside straight tail carriers are held, and, rotated by driving plates. Do you want more videos about mechanical engineering, like, comment, share, and, subscribe.